come back to your friends if you need order, and I'm back in Kidlocker, um, I'll find the Kingmaker. Um, last time we killed a few of the evil guys. Straightforward. Where is this coming from? You want an old man like me to fight? My help, your fight. <laughs> Coward's excuse are predictable. Bandits here bother you as much as Svetlana and Oleg, maybe more. No, it's good. We leveled up, so we have now plus seven to diplomacy. Let's do this. Ha! Uh, well, right. I'll show the makers. They learned better. At least an old man around. Someone might even write up verses about me. Maybe even heroic ones. Yeah, not really, but. Let's. let's yeah, yeah, he's the guy living here doing something. So that he will help us as well. Let's run around. See if we can find stuff. The way seems clear. Quiet footsteps. Nothing up there, so there's also creeps. Use traps to help catch the bandits. Fear not, I'll stand between you and the swamp. You're under my protection. Ah, I should have taken the... I should have taken the heavy crossbow in hand. It was more than all that. <laughs> See, you're not easy to cow. I beg you, be careful, but please don't let me lose anything to risk. Go. Looking to me. 
to go when we talk. Uh, really, 6 hours, 40 minutes, we need to wait. This will take forever to take back our friend. <laughs> them apart! Your death awaits.
I'll loot your corpse. No, probably not. So slow. Is this because of my? Uh, once he shakes it, yeah, man, it's near you, rats. Now they'll know better than to treat honest people like cattle. Yeah, yeah, whatever. And now Bokken, he taught them a thing or two as well. Now, my lady, head on up to the guest rooms on the before you insert some rest after such a battle. I need to clean things up. Okay. Hey, we gained some money. Our first taxes. Precisely. Okay, here we can put Damn stuff. Damn this silly thing! Or probably not. Stash. Is this stash or is this our stash now? That's ah, this is really our stash. So here we can put stuff in that we want to keep but don't want to sell. Uh, we want to run around with. Uh, this we want to sell. We'll probably equip this thing. Let's see. Um, it does make more damage. It's heavier. Hmm. Maybe not. It's the same range. seem to be anyway a portion of what you will take this take the this one this one
because it's quite nice. So if we take the braces on, we wouldn't change our AC, would we? Would he? Just for uh, magicians. Okay. A book. Little wisp with an amusing glowing ball, which looks harmless and doesn't arouse any natural suspicion. And hence the hiding light in the worship. It follows to certain death. Yeah. They are really terrible. I really hate little wisps. Werewolves prefer to hunt in groups and attack lone travelers. It's entirely possible that the Varigian camp or troop turn into a pack of bloodthirsty lycanthropes. Primals. Powerful creatures of the primal realm. Yeah, whatever. Let's get to bed. Ah, you wake up from a nasty dream that tortured you almost all night. Hmm. In it, you say, saw a ball of unnatural thick fog that surrounded you. Slowly moving closer and closer, you look out the window and you find out. Or was not not a figment of your imagination, not a dream, and then hear me, please hear me. Can you hear me? Yeah. Please. It seems that only you can see or hear the nymph. Okay. Yeah. The other schlafen. The others are asleep, so and they see her. Oh well, let's ask. Who am I? <laughs> Just a tear shed by the land itself. A bitter sigh of nature. I am a nymph, the guardian of this area. A defeated guardian. Call me the guardian of the bloom, if you wish. Um, I'll have to turn down the music can I options game settings auto pause uh, special options turn beat mode nah, sound there it is let's turn the music down I'm glad my adventure begins with such beautiful sight. Beauty side. is really? so tender. It can so easily be crushed under the blows of cruel fate. But you can save it from being yeah, undone. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Aid. Salvation. We have a common enemy, and long have I searched for someone who can defeat him. The one you call the Stag Lord. As a storm strikes ruthlessly with gusts and lightning, the Stag Lord wreaks havoc with the swords of his servants. Mm -hmm. And not just in the world of people. The land also suffers from the evil he brings. My forests and my flowers suffocate in this fog. Soon even I will vanish as the last ray of light fades at dusk. And it wouldn't be too bad if I can remember the story. The Stag Lord is responsible for... Yes. It hides his fortress as well as his dark deeds. But while responsible, he did not create this affliction. It is the work of a powerful druid who has betrayed even himself. I know not why the powers did not leave this renegade, but even I was unable to defeat him. 
Mm-hmm. This fog, it enshrouds, entangles, suffocates. If only I could learn how it was created. But my powers wane. I have barely the strength to call out to you. All I know for certain is that somewhere in this forest lies an old house. And it echoes with the remnants of a strange power. The Stag Lord and his druid were there. The fog hides this place from me, but I can point you to the bandit's camp yeah, near the Thornford. Make them tell you where this place is. Go there and listen to the echo. Catch the whispers. Search for anything that can tell you how the fog was created. Whatever. Once the fog clears, nature will breathe again. And okay. you will be able to eat I don't yeah, yeah, whatever. believe in we should fate, go there stranger. and find out but how our this meeting fog seems to be. more than a coincidence okay so we got a new quest hey all the other guys are gone why is that Oriel and eight eyes. Ah, oh, yeah, I know. We can buy some heroes from her. Some generic heroes. So, good day. I hope you're feeling all right after that battle. I can't thank you enough for. Can't thank you enough for what you've done. Definitely don't want to waste your time. But if you have a moment, I have a request. This is a very personal request and maybe not important enough for your time, probably. I'll completely understand if you say no, but the first time the Stag Lords thugs came here demanding money, they also took my wedding ring, just tore it off my hand. Just a trinket, really, but I'm, it meant so much to me. Ugh. I remember every moment of the day all that came to me the ring in hand to ask if I'd marry him. I was standing in a fancy dress on the stairs of my father's home, fearing that I'd misheard something or that I'd say something stupid and everyone around would laugh. Okay, whatever. We are not interested because we are lawful evil. Even if we were not evil, we wouldn't bother. If you happen, blah 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 blah. I'd be happy to help. I can't promise anything. But if I do come across a ring, I'll return it to you. I have more important things to worry about. Yeah, let's do this. Tell me about yourself. Really? Do we want to hear that? Oleg's idea, though I support him in it. We didn't realize how dangerous it was. It of course, and the rest of everyone respects everyone's accustomed to relying on them. Even the mention of someone like Lady Jamandi could be enough to fend off the street dog or some other trouble. Maybe even work in some places here, but not with this man. Okay. Mm, he's not just some average bandit. If no one puts it, he'll turn the stolen lands into his personal kingdom, kingdom of fear and oppression. Fear always follows power. It would be naive to think that that god is so much different from any other ruler. Hmm. You may be right, but life without hope is just. And bye. So, how about you? Who are you? The Elf Grum. Noriel Eight Eyes. Once upon a time I was famous throughout Epsilon. The Noriel Eight Eyes of the Reckless Six. Well, glory passes quickly. A few miserable decades later and no one recognizes you on the street anymore. What a shame. Epsilon. Uh, blah 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 blah. 
a city at the center of the world. Okay. I sit here waiting for adventurers who are in need of help. We may be sitting here in a backwards woods tavern, but in Absalom, I have a lot of friends who are eager to make a few coins. They have brave hearts, but shallow pockets. A little gold would be welcome and change for them. And send them a message. Will come from Absalom through the through a portal. If you're interested, just give me a sign and we'll arrange everything right away. Okay. So we can buy companions here. <clears throat> um, this will cost 2,000 gold pieces. Oh, why not? Just this. Where are you? Blah, blah, blah. Long ago, I could spot an enemy and pin him to the wall before he could even think of attack. Some said I had deep eyes and looked all around at once. It seems I've outlived my nickname. Uh, okay. I've been drinking much lately. It's best I don't test my skills too often. Yeah, you, when the trading post was attacked, I was hunting. A little lost in the mist. First time that's happened to me. I guess I should go easier on the drink. But don't you imagine? Ahead of a good fight. If only I'd known I was missing all the action. But I see you've got everything under control. Okay. Would you like to join me? Ah, no. Got enough things to do already. You'd better manage it on your own. You want to know how one could exchange the life of a pathfinder for a sorry drunken rattle? <laughs> you lose all your friends because of one scumbag and then you'll understand. I was the only one to return from the final campaign of the Reckless Six. Whatever is left of me can't be called a sinner anymore. Oh, blah 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 blah. Here's the story. Our leader, Vermelt, was the best of us. Wise, brave, friends with everyone. One of those friends, Edivion Adrissant, sent him a disturbing letter. He stumbled upon mention of some ancient book on the art of necromancy. Secrets like those are best left forever. Trust in what that kind of magic can do. To make a long story short, these volumes were supposed to be hidden in the catacombs of Gallows Spire. We decided that the books should be retrieved and kept safe by the society. We gathered in a tavern, discussed the expedition, and proceeded to our love. It was a normal mission, a quick and quiet recovery. Noriel smiles bitterly, but everything turned out to be much more complicated. Daddy made it through the Witchgate Forest, all those terrible living trees on the druids and their arches of bone. It was a miracle we managed to make it out alive. Then ran church to stop. It was marked on Vermelt's map as a safe enough haven to hold up in the blah 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 whatever. They all died. Our final society, what exactly, blah blah. Oh god, so much information. What is the purpose? It's a school of adventurers. Search for those who are eager to test their skills. Blah, blah, blah. What kind of members? What sort of adventurers? We have representatives from all races, religions and beliefs. The Grand Lodge is an app. But there are many smaller lodges throughout the area. <laughs> are we in Golarion? I think. Yeah, that's that. Blah blah blah. Who does the society support? I mean, who does it serve? No one in particular. Okay, let's see. Do we have some 2,000 gold? 
don't have enough money for it. Okay. We don't have. Let's see if we have enough wares of the That long sword. Book rope. Don't we need this brace and we need to reduce person personal? I don't think so. I hope not. Mm -hmm. We still don't have two thousand gold, but nearly. Uh, I just dislike the noise. I'm from the rest of it is a complicated lots of people and each with a place on the shelf. Blah 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 blah. People take care of the stag lord. That's quite a task you set yourself on. Stag lord has a fortress somewhere in the area. I don't need a few chosen from the most trusted on this on his travel ever invited. The location of the fortress is a heavily guarded secret. And with the fog hanging around, I'd imagine it would be even harder to find. What else can you tell me about this deck board? Not much. Not like I've sat down and shared a cup of wine with the man, you know. But I think he arrived in the Southern Lands less than a year ago. Kill a person if they so much as disagree with him, he never reveals his face. Those who've seen him up close report the same thing. Ugly scar in not covered by the stack what pass is a mystery. <sighs> he just arrived one day. He was immediately a power reckoned with. I guess the most surprising thing about him is in that he has as many followers who admire him as he has millions, millions who obey him out of fear. He's got some inner friend feeling, or maybe inner madness. Blah blah blah, blah. we'll speak another time. Okay. You've got some quick I'm, I'm sure. Ah, old Bokken still knows if you're drinking. Yes, yeah, yeah. I help you in any way. Fangberry Cave has been revealed. There's a cave nearby. I used to pick berries. Spiders. Ah, oh, yeah, I can remember. This was a terrible, really, really terrible um, quest. Because the spiders are not killable. Radishes. They are a rare, mysterious plant. Don't know where to find them, but I know that kobolds gather them and value them highly. Okay. Want to know, huh? 
Well, I'll gladly tell you after you bring it to me, okay? Whatever. Got those tasks to do those. Show me what you have. He's got a lot of uh, these things. Ooh, even bombs. Nice. But I really don't need it now. I mean, these would be great in the fight against the spiders, but I don't want to. <sighs> I don't want to buy too much right now because I I want some. Where are the? Where is the game? Okay. Oh, there's a Miri. Okay, I'll talk to her, but then we will stop for. We're gonna talk. All right, spill it on this thing. Depends. Then we, what we're gonna talk at? At monsters or swords or scars, I approve. That's good. Oh uh, yeah, that, you bet it's not simple. Check out. Okay. Ooh. What did we do? Oh. Uh, belong to a real blasted frost giant. I killed him. Fits me perfect. My damn trophy. Uh, yeah. Uh, similar question seems to puzzle Amiri. She scratches her blah blah blah. What's it like to be a barbarian in the Six Bears tribe? Half of our people are big and strong. But the monster in half with one swing. We can walk three days and nights with no rest. And eat like our rocks. We need a lot of training to become so strong. Training? Ha ha ha. No one freaking trained me. The voice of the Six Bears got all I could do was walk. And you know what? They were still crap even after all that training because I kicked their butts hard. Okay. Animals, bandits, monsters. All thought they were stronger than me. Idiots. Miri spits on the ground. Because if you start a fight, you think you can win. You think you're stronger than your enemy. I defeated them all. See all the scars of my on my face. Uh, what does the realm of the Navan floor look like? Huge and freezing. No place. For <laughs> tribes hunt Aurochs herds to survive. Aurochs is fast, so I follow herd for days, just to not die for hun of hunger. If you're weak, you stay behind and die in the tribe. You cannot. Why did you leave your tribe? Because they were assholes, all of them. Mina were cowards and scoundrels, and women were scared like sheep. I mean, they think no girl can be a fighter because they are weak. Way the woman can beat them. And females just nod. Ah, we are an all female group now. I see. Because fights could be watch kids. What's that's what they always say, but I'm a warrior, damn it. I won't cook high and watch meat. Okay. Probably not the right uh thing to talk about. Mm-hmm. He was not recognized as a <laughs> Quite good, huh? Cool. If I was a crappy male, I'd fight better. Is that what you said? 
Or you say I could be of like go get some training Amiri, right? I meant exactly what I said. Why did you don't raise your voice to me ever again? and strong. Everyone's afraid of me. I can't play the softy. Who would ever fear me then? I enjoy being feared when I pass by and all the sissies almost faint knees, trembling teeth, chattering shit dripping down their palms. Miri falls silent, fascinated with the picture her imagination has created. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Uh, I don't need your help, no. Thanks for talking. And dialogue, okay. Yeah, she'll... Kill this thing again. Oh, it's Jeffel. And your friends, for today, we stop. Next time, we will go on our search for the stack. Until then, bye.